So I wasn't really planning on making this video, but for the past couple of weeks, my videos have been reviews and spoiler talk and stuff like that. So I do apologize for overloading your feeds with a bunch of reviews and spoiler talks, but I feel like I should have a little discussion about Hasbro PulseCon because that's coming out in the next couple of days. And people have been asking me, am I going to stream my reaction to Hasbro PulseCon? Maybe, maybe not. It's going to be at like 2 in the morning for me, so I don't know if I am going to stream it. I'll have to wait and see. Um, but I'll definitely be watching it, even if I'm not streaming it. But uh, Hasbro PulseCon is going to be a big thing for Power Rangers. It's going to be 45 minutes, but in that 45 minutes, they're going to be cramming in a lot of information. They're going to have stuff talking about the toys, the comics, and Dino Fury Season 2 and some kind of Cosmic Fury news. Now, with the comics, they're going to have Ryan and Melissa on, which is great, because Ryan can go on there and promote issue 100, because it's a big milestone for the Power Ranger comics, which, check out my review for Power Rangers issue 100, or MMPR issue 100, and then you can have Melissa on there, because Melissa is taking over the comics after Ryan, starting with issue 101 in October. So, it's sort of a good way to promote what Ryan's doing, and then promote what Melissa is doing in the next story arc and stuff like that. Because I don't believe much has been seen apart from what was seen at San Diego Comic Con. But I haven't seen all the stuff that came out from that like uh, Mistress Vile from what I've heard. I haven't seen any of those images floating around online unfortunately. So hopefully we'll get to see those designs in the paddle. And then we're going to have Andre Black Nerd Comedy. Um, gotta love Andre. Hyperforce Blue, Eddie, um, Andre is going to be doing a Dino Fury panel, and on the Dino Fury panel, you're going to have all six Rangers and Simon Bennett, and Simon Bennett being there is very interesting. Now, he was there last year for Season 2 talk to promote Season 2. I think he was kind of like the special guest that they sprung on everyone, which was really cool, but Simon being announced is kind of a big deal. Now, they have teased they're going to talk about Power Rangers Dino Fury Season 2, which makes sense. The season drops uh, tomorrow or today by the time you're watching this video. It should be out now, um, or soon, depending on when you watch this video. Um, but no doubt about it, they're going to have the cast talk about that in their favourite moments of Season 2, and try not to spoil too much, that has been spoiled. Um, but they also said they'll be talking about Season 29 and beyond. So season 29 being Dino Fury season 2. Now, the, the beyond part is interesting because that means Cosmic Fury news. What kind of Cosmic Fury news we're going to get? No idea. But I'm not expecting something big and uh, revelation-y uh, for Cosmic Fury. I think what we're going to get for Cosmic Fury is some kind of tease, but I don't think it's going to be a big trailer with all the actors in there because I don't think they're in New Zealand yet so I get the feeling we're going to get a mock-up trailer kind of like when Dino Fury was announced and Beast Morphers was announced with whatever footage they filmed or stock footage or uh, stock trailer footage kind of like the original Dino Fury trailer for season one um, but I have no idea what they're going to reveal for Cosmic Fury. I'm not going to get my head my head up, my hopes or my head up too high thinking it's going to be Sentai adaptation because seeing how Dino Fury ends, I do wonder if they're moving away from the Sentai, which is another discussion within itself, which Dawson Riders done, the fan club's done, so I might throw my hat into the arena for that later down the line. We'll see what happens after Hasbro PulseCon, but... I don't know what we're going to get for Hasbro PulseCon when it comes to Cosmic Fury. Maybe the actual full theme song, no idea. But it's an interesting tease to see some kind of Cosmic Fury news later down the line because they are working on it in New Zealand right now and Simon's hard at work working on it right now. So whatever they're going to reveal should be big and important. Now, I don't have any wild predictions for Hasbro PulseCon when it comes to Power Rangers. I mean, they pretty much laid out all their cards on the table by revealing Ryan and the Dino Fury cast and stuff like that. Uh, it kind of shows what we're in for. 
And I feel like there's going to be most of the toy stuff we know about if you follow Josh on Toku Topics and Living Ranger Key. If you follow Josh, you're kind of in the know when it comes to the Power Ranger toys. So check out Josh at Toku Topics for all the Power Ranger Lightning Collection news and stuff like that. It's where I get my Lightning Collection news from, which is fun to watch other content creators and get the word from them. So... I don't think we're going to get any crazy reveals because with the Astro Mega, Mega ship uh, being leaked or revealed by press releases on uh, Saturday this week, like last weekend, then I feel like all the big cards on the table have been set. We just have to see how Hasbro is going to do the presentation. And knowing that it's going to be like 45 minutes, close to an hour, that is kind of wor 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 worrying some. I cannot speak right now. It's kind of wor worrying, um, yeah, I can't speak right now. It is concerning with how much they're going to fit into that one panel without making it seem like they're just flying by like that uh, Hasbro Fan First Pinata Tuesday thing they did. Um, so it is kind of concerning, but hey, we'll see what happens, we'll see what happens. I get the feeling that a lot of these interviews are pre-recorded, so hopefully nothing too bad can go wrong. But... We'll see what happens, we'll see what happens. But anyway guys, what are your predictions and hopes for Power Rangers at PulseCon? What do you think we'll see when it comes to Dino Fury related? Tell me in the comment section down below. I'd love to hear your thoughts and opinions. And don't forget to hit those buttons. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Turn on notifications. And I will see you guys later. Peace out, take care. Bye.